So this is the issue that motivated me to go ahead and create this video because I feel like Google Maps has to have a better way to optimize for the most efficient route when it comes to many locations and it does not and we'll actually cover that MapQuest does and does so beautifully and there's no reason why Google Maps can't figure out that for instance let's say I was planning to start at Paramus Public Library and end at Paramus public library but I have to visit all of these locations in between so maybe I need to drop something off maybe I need to collect payment maybe I need to come photograph them and I'm not sure which order is best and so I'm just putting it in and hoping that Google tells me which order is best but it actually doesn't do that all it does is show us the map in this exact order and there's no options for me to select the most efficient route the the only thing that it allows me to do is to avoid highways, tolls and ferries or the distance units whether I want it in miles or kilometers but there's no way for it to figure out what the optimal route is. This will be so helpful for delivery drivers, for photographers, for anyone that visits their clients or just wants to visit a bunch of places and figure out the best way to do it. Maybe people on vacation that want to visit a bunch of places cannot do it optimally using Google Maps because this is the map it gave me. It's all scattered here and it says it's going to take me two hours. Well, if I go ahead and I put the same exact map into MapQuest and then I go ahead and I select reorder stops for the most optimized route, you will see that it's smart enough to leave Paramus Borough Library as the place that I started and Paramus Town Square, the place that I specified to finish last, and it's going to show me all of these in between. Take a look at how organized this map is. It's saying, okay, if you start at Paramus, you might want to go to Westwood first, then Ridgewood, Glenrock, Haledon, then circle around Salbrook, Hackensack, and come right back to Paramus. This is so helpful for me to know. Look at how amazing this is. It's actually telling me that this entire trip is going to take one hour and 17 minutes and the IRS reimbursement is going to be $22.89. I assume they're referring to, if I'm doing this for business purposes, this will be my IRS reimbursement for the amount of miles, which they say is 35 miles. I also want to point out it's better for the environment. So check this out. Here it's saying the entire trip is 35 miles an hour 17 minutes and Google is specifying that the entire trip is 58.4 miles and two hours and there's no way to optimize it. Don't you find it absolutely ridiculous that a platform like MapQuest has this? MapQuest. I remember my dad printing out sheets of paper with instructions on how to get to ShopRite from his house and then storing it in the glove compartment box of his minivan. The team behind Google Maps, can you please try not to be behind MapQuest? Can you try not to fall behind the ball on this one? Fix this issue.